this is Gary Hines with Faith Covenant Ministries again, and uh, welcome to this special edition of Meet the Team with Sylvia Miley. And uh, it's always a <laughs> joy to be with Sylvia. And uh, she has a contagious laugh, among some other things that uh, she's noted for across the nation and around the world. Uh, but, uh, <laughs> We, we just wanted to come on and encourage you about our upcoming National FCM Conference, Refreshing Faith, July 20th through the 23rd, Cherry Hill Holiday Inn in Cherry Hill, New Jersey. And so, uh, Sylvia, it's, it's going to be a power-packed conference. Uh, man, last year, we were all doing this by uh, little, little guys on the screen, and uh, yes. even though the sessions uh, we were able to see what people look like in real life <laughs> on their <laughs> teaching times but uh, it's going to be good to be back together again amen yes exciting for such a time as this i believe and it says to uh meet together don't uh uh <laughs> don't, get the don't forsake your oh, forsake the assembly of your Selves together in all the more, and we've seen things happen all the more as the day of the Lord approaches that we're at the end of the end time. So now is not the time to uh, back down from your faith, from meeting together, from being around one another. And so coming together uh, as a team of people to encourage one another and to see God's spirit move. Amen. You know, I, I really believe that, uh, you know, the conferences have always been encouraging and inspirational as well as times where people have just been blessed and had things imparted to them. But I, I really think that not only the timing, but the, the topic of the conference this year, the theme of the conference, refreshing faith, especially with all that's going on politically, yes. culturally, nationally, and internationally, obviously the Ukrainian, Russian thing, Israel and Iran, so many other uh, mm -hmm. geopolitical, uh, China and Taiwan. I mean, uh, it, the, the list as, as it goes, and it keeps on going and going and going. Uh, but what a timely topic. Amen. That says that we go from faith to faith and glory to glory. And we need to constantly hear the word of God. Faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word. And uh, like Nancy Dufresne says that your uh, faith has a short shelf life. It's not like a Twinkie that you can leave on the shelf for 25 years, that it's that constant hearing, constant getting into the word and being built up that new challenges we need that renewed faith to go forward amen well this year's conference uh the the one of our guest speakers is somebody that has over 50 years of ministry started his ministry in panama and then he and his wife jackie at that time were missionaries and ministers in Mexico. And uh, so who is our, I, I've been given information about it, but who is it, Sylvia? We have Terry Mize coming. And again, 56 years, uh, one story about him being in Mexico. He picked up a hitchhiker and almost immediately the hitchhiker pulls out a gun says, I'm going to kill you, Terry Mice says, no, you're not, said, yes, I am, pulled the trigger, five shots, uh, point blank range, and none of them penetrated him, and he had the opportunity to lead him to the Lord, so this man walks in faith, he speaks faith, and it's going to be a time of an awesome move of God. Amen, you know, and it's one of the things I, I'm so excited about hearing Terry and having him come to the conference this year is that 
not only is he a, a man of faith and a man of power, but he's a man that's got the world on his heart and uh, yes. goes uh, unto the uttermost. I believe he's got uh, one of his themes is uh, reaching the unreached uh, and telling the untold. And, uh, you know, that that resonates with my heart uh, <laughs> with regards to reaching out to unreached people group and especially people in missions around the world. But Terry's not the only thing that we've got going on. We've got some other things happening as well. Yes. Uh, also, William Lockman, who is a man of faith and power and who uh, started their church, Faith Outreach Church in Clarksville, Tennessee, 1989. So 33 years speaking word of faith, uh, speaking uh, and encouraging people. So he always has an encouraging, positive word that uh, grows your faith. And uh, also all of our team members speak. I will be speaking on Wednesday night, but all of our uh, team members, we will have workshops during the day. We also have Children's Church with Becky Noon. All she's right. Been, she's been involved in children's ministry uh, for years and at the conference. And everyone loves Miss Becky. The puppets and puppet stage are going to be back. And uh, lots of activities, hearing the word of God and uh, growing and in faith and having fun at the same time. Amen. And then and go ahead. Go ahead. And then Carrie Thompson, who again uh, is going to be doing the youth. And again, it's been on my heart, and we've had some classes for youth the last couple of years, but it's been on my heart to have them in a a uh, classroom setting where they can have their needs met. And so they'll be meeting during the day while the workshops are going on. And again, it'll be middle school and high school. So uh, Carrie wanted to concentrate on um, school grades rather than ages, but approximately 12 through 19 that we would be having ministry. And then they are going to be also serving in some capacity during the evening services. And she's gonna be teaching them on serving during the day workshops too. Amen. Also, she, um, Carrie in 2019, her and her team did a, a wonderful, um, dance to a song, and I heard that there's something in the works about that too. So, that we're going to be blessed with a presentation uh, during the conference. So, exciting things going on. You don't want to miss. Amen. It is a family conference, not only for the family of FCM, but for your family and the family of your congregation, the families in your congregation. And uh, what are the dates again, Sylvia? July 20th through the 23rd. Again, it'll be starting Wednesday evening at uh, seven o'clock. Then we will be uh, adjourning meeting then Thursday morning uh, classes. Then we'll have a break during uh, the afternoon meeting back again, Thursday evening uh, and so on. Wonderful, you know, and listen, I wanna encourage you, if you haven't registered yet, you can go to the website, faithcovenantministries.com, click on uh, the, just below the icon on conferences and it'll take you to a direct link where you can learn more information about the conference as well as register. And uh, you have a blue light special, Sylvia, until June 1st, I believe. So fill us in on that blue light special. It's flashing around me somewhere. 
Yes, actually it was till April 1st, but this year I'm speaking about favor. And so for all of those who register by June 1st, you get 15% off of the cost. And also we have a youth uh, price, which is uh, cheaper. So then you get it for dirt cheap by the time you take the 15% off. <laughs> so again, come one, come all, bring your friends, family, and again, ministry for all ages. Amen, amen. And uh, I would just say this, that uh, uh, one of the things that maybe has, we've heard different things over the years about the facilities and uh, all of that. Listen, the Holiday Inn in Cherry Hill, it's newly remodeled, almost yes. brand new rooms. Uh, I think they've had those rooms now. Uh, I think they were getting them taken care of just prior to the pandemic. And then, of course, last year we weren't able to meet. But uh, they're relatively new rooms. Uh, it's going to be a, a much better facility than in the past couple of years where we've had our family together in uh, New Jersey. So, listen, you're, you won't want to miss it. Again, July 20th yes. through the 23rd. And um, it'll, it'll be a wonderful, wonderful time. Terry Mize, William Luffman, our own Sylvia Miley, and of course, uh, you as pastors and leaders, part of our FCM family, encourage your congregation to come and get your faith not only renewed, but revived, as well as refreshed, refreshing faith, the theme of this year's conference. Sylvia, would you pray for the conference and for our FCM family before we wrap this up today? Yes, thank you, Lord, that for such a time as this, that we are in the kingdom. It's an exciting time. And that even as we come together to hear your word, to fellowship, to uh, breaking of bread and uh, apostles teaching, all of these that we would grow and that each and every person that comes, that those things that they need, the very things that they need to hear would be imparted to them, that those uh, things that are spoken, the messages that you're already preparing uh, each person to give, that it would be anointed and appointed for this time. And we thank you and praise you that every need would be met for people to come, the finances that they need, the time off that they need, that you would give them favor with their jobs, favor with every situation that they have, that you would surround them continually with a shield of favor so that every provision can be made and even exceedingly and abundantly above all that they could ask or think. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Well, listen, again, don't forget National FCM Conference in Cherry Hill, Holiday Inn, Cherry Hill, New Jersey, July 20th through the 23rd. Our special guest, Terry Mize, and along with William and Sylvia and our whole team. Listen, uh, there's been some new people connect with FCM, even since a conference last year that was held virtually. Um, and come and meet them and be a part of the family. We look forward to seeing you and get your registration in to take advantage of that blue light, cheaper than dirt special. God bless <laughs> you. Remember, you're loved and there's nothing you can do about it. Be a family.